Yo, y'all know what it is, y'all know what it ain't uh, Right here on your screen you have Fendi Boy Or Rich Fendi, whichever one he goes by now He been doing a lot of interviews lately Saying that the case that, you know Was the unthinkable, the unspeakable You know what I'm saying He's been going around saying pretty much that It was, um, the case was the case was dropped and this right here this mickey truth was exposing him at first when i first did the story about um the paperwork dropping and this the paperwork uh fendi boy has violated the um agreements and the conditions of his bond so he's been reincarcerated he, he caught that break right before chicago took away the cash bond or just the whole bond policies and different things like that so now for certain cases i'm pretty sure like this one you're gonna have to sit in the trial and he sat for about a year close to a year something like that year and a half and then he got bond right before they started this shit and then unfor i can't say unfortunately you know you you know what you did fendi jerry jerry reeves gerald reeves or something like that you know what you did and so now he back in Cook County. And the first time he was in Cook County, he checked himself in PC smart. He was smart for doing that because I don't know how the inside of that motherfucker worked. What's the politics about how they still handle people like this? Because when I was, when I caught my pipe case, I was in there with an Arab dude. And he was molesting his daughter and plus his stepson from the time they was babies. And he got finally got caught for it because the girl was 14. She told on him. And ain't nobody ended up getting on his ass nothing like that. You know, he was quiet, tucked off to the side. But ain't no, we was all talking shit, of course. But ain't nobody like, approach him, smack him. Of course you couldn't. But I mean, like, when he actually check on deck. I don't know what happened with that because I got the, I got bond. You did, thank God. But it's already unthinkable and unspeakable and i feel so bad for the victims involved because i don't have siblings all i have is a mother and a female that i caught that i love de dearly and i could just imagine if somebody ever tried to hurt them hurt like you, you gotta die and the fact that if this is true because we all seen duty low like let's not jump the gun just because fendi boy goofy and other things you want to call him duty low is falsely accused of this he even got on footage saying he was molested by a, a different a babysitter or something like that and people were trying to hang him i reported on a story but you know you got to keep an open eye to it or open ear i mean just for all the facts and he beat the charges it, it was all false so if this shit is false he gonna beat it if not what's done in the dark gonna come to the light and you gonna have your day for boy get in the comment section let me know what y'all think below i'm gone